We are on our estuary tour looking for crocodiles and monkeys and birds. Successful estuary adventure. We saw a bunch of monkeys. We saw a couple baby crocodiles, one big crocodile, iguanas, lots of birds. It was great. We had Enrique and he remembered us. So, two thumbs up. Very good, you. We just did a chocolate tasting. It was so fun. We did chocolate bars starting at 100% cacao, all the way down to white chocolate. Then we did a sipping chocolate tasting. It was wonderful. And then we bought, of course, a couple bars of chocolate to take home. So I would definitely recommend Reina's. You're gonna see the signs all over if you're headed to Tamarindo. Um, and we finally made it and we're so glad we did because it was really fun, really educational and delicious. We are back at Falafel Bar because it was so good. We didn't dare go anywhere else because we only have two more days here and we want to come here again. Hello vlog. It is our last full day in Tamarindo. We fly out tomorrow. Um, I am going to San Jose. I'm gonna spend a week in the city. So we're just doing little errands today. It rained this morning actually. Um, but it stopped, so we walked downtown and got some souvenirs. Now we're going to co the coffee shop Nordico so that we can pick up some coffee to bring home and some coffees for tomorrow morning because we're going to be not like in a rush going to the airport, but like, you know, when you like time out exactly how long it's going to get there and the time you need. I just don't want to deal like the one thing. I love Nordico, but sometimes it can be like a little bit slow and I just don't want to deal with like being stressed out if there's like a line there or if it's, you know, taking a while. So we're gonna get our coffee today um, and hopefully do some swimming later. It's cloudy again, kind of looks like it's gonna rain again, but I hope we get to see the sunset one more time here. We're also gonna go back to Chiquita, which was a really cool bar we went to two nights ago and eat there, they have Mexican food. So um, we're gonna do Mexican for dinner and I don't know, just enjoy. Um, there's a lot of good food here, but some of the restaurants are just like not that great for the prices you pay. So we figured rather than go back to a place that's just, we already know is so-so, we're gonna try this new, new place. They've actually only been open for a couple weeks. So um, I will definitely be filming there, but it's like, it'll be dark, so it'll be kind of hard to see. Um, but it's really cool. They have like, they had a DJ the other night and they have all craft cocktails that are delicious, amazing. Um, so you probably saw that already from the other night. So that is the plan for today, for our last day. I'm really gonna miss the beach so much. Um, and I think like spending a whole week in the city is gonna be a lot, but I'm gonna be by myself. I'm not gonna have a car. So it just made the most sense to like go there. I know people there already that I'm gonna be seeing. So that should be good. And that will be its own vlog, I'm sure. So. <laughs> I will let you know if anything else fun happens today. It's our last day and this is what's happening. It is our last night and we are at Chiquita's again and it is pouring out. So luckily they have like this cover on the bar because it is kind of like a very open air restaurant, which is super cool, but luckily it's not sideways raining on us. So we just ordered our drinks. I got a margarita. We got a mezcalita, which is like a margarita with mezcal. And then we got guacamole dip, chorizo, like a, it's like a queso fundido. Sounds really good. And we're gonna get tacos.
Here's our car. We are now returning. She was good to us. We did great. It was excellent. I am at the airport waiting for the thing to open for me to check in for my flight to San Jose and I am just nervous because the weight allowance for your bag is 30 pounds and mine is 45 and apparently I can pay more but I don't know until until they actually take it I'm like freaked out so I'm hoping that that all goes well I wish they would just open up so we could deal with it but I need to be patient and I'm sure everything's gonna be fine. They're gonna weigh me to see where to put me on the plane. <laughs> oh, that's gonna be me. Wait, Pequeño. <laughs> I'm walking to my plane. It's so cute. There it is. There it is. It is so cute. So, bedroom, bathroom, pretty nice for like how small it is, it's nice. Okay, and then <laughs> record player, TV, seating area, I guess. We've got our kitchen, table, that's the outside. Oh, that's a very small fridge. That's okay though. It's just me here. Oh, cute. Okay. All right. I'm excited. We are here. We've got our San Jose view. It is rainy. As you can see, very cloudy. I'm a little overwhelmed because I need to get food. Like I have nothing here except coffee and some plantain chips. So I need to go out and it's raining and I have a jacket, but I don't have an umbrella. And I know it's fine, but I'm just overwhelmed in the moment. Um, probably tomorrow maybe I will go to a store by like an Uber or something. Um, I don't know, we'll, we'll figure it out. We've got some time to figure this all out. I'm going exploring to see what is in my building. I'm going to check out the laundry. Here is the laundry room. Ta-da! The pet 
shower is very conveniently located right around the corner from the elevator. Here's the gym. Also, water bar. Not bad, there's more over there. I just don't want to be weird and film people. Cool. This will work. Oh, let's see what they have. 20s. is warm but it seems like it's closed Wah. I'm in a padded room right now I think this is like a furniture moving elevator maybe um, I'm now going to the 29th floor for I forget what more stuff Oh my god, 